Hey YouTube, um, I got me a zero gauge amp kit from New Concepts. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? It's on here somewhere. There it is. There it is right there. Approximately weighs about 13 pounds. 13 pounds to 5 ounces actually. Alright, we're going to open this with a steak knife. Excellent. Alright, courtesy of my mother. Sounded weird, but we'll go with it. Okay, let's see. How, how am I going to do this? Don't want to just stab me. Let's do the steak knife. We got we got tape over here. I can just rip right off. Ripping off the tape. Maybe. There we go. I think. No, now we can now we can use the steak knife. Stab it. Stab it. Go. All right. Uh, turn it outside. Thirteen pounds is pretty heavy. All right. My bad. I covered. I covered the camera. Not really a smart idea on my part. I'm new to this. It's okay. But I got plenty more videos to come, including the install of this. All right. Man, they really, they really sealed this down. Look, you can glue a hot glue or something. Oh, okay. All right, it looks, looks like we got a second box. Oh my god, a second box. I'm pumped. All right, let's, let's take a look at what we got here. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's see what we got here. We got, we got the room tubing. Correct me if I'm wrong on calling it that, okay? Zip ties. It's awesome. Um, these these I'll save for later because that's actually not part of the amp kit. But whatever. Um, all right, here we go. Zero gauge wire. It's actually a lot bigger in person than I would have thought. And a lot heavier. Holy crap. Okay. Now we're just gonna try and move this this side. Sorry about the moving the camera around, but it has to be done. Yeah, and all zero gauge wire. Just gonna pop that on my kitchen chair. Nice kitchen chair. Okay. And here is the zero gauge, the ground wire. Get a look at that. It's actually really nice. All right, I think that's enough. I also ordered two extra ring terminals, blue ones, plus I got these ones right here. They actually came with the amp kit. 300 amp fuse, can't go wrong. And these over here, battery terminal. Pretty sure I ordered two of these, so if I can't find the other one, I'm going to be kind of upset, but you know, stuff happens. Alright. Okay, uh, alright. Now, what else do we got here? Got the fuse holder. Nice fuse holder. Made in China. Excellent. China makes good stuff. Oh, here we go. I think this might be the other. Look how, look how much they, they wrap this. That's ridiculous. There's no reason to tape all that. Okay, almost almost just dropped my phone. I'm, I'm videotaping this with MD3, by the way. Getting the door is the 21st, so hopefully the camera will be a lot better on that one. Alright, this is.
Now there is a difference between positive and negative battery terminals. And I'm not sure which one this is, but it basically, basically got pretty good weight to it. Alright, see so yeah, it's got three zero gauge openings. That's what it looks like on the bottom. Not bad, not bad. Alright. So look at they got directions on how to put wire in into it. That's awesome. There's my finger. The finger shouldn't be doing that. Okay. Now let me look here. You don't want to forget it. One one of these is positive, one of these is negative. I'll figure that out later. But for now, like I said, zero gauge wire, positive, and the ground. Power and ground, whatever you want to call it. Alright. Obviously I got a nice sub to hook to hook this up to. But that hasn't been ordered yet. I'll show you that a little later. We got the two battery terminals, there's one, there's two, uh, the fuse holder, 300 amp fuse, ring terminals, both of them, nice, alright, and, hey, what you got, alright, got, got the order slip, that's cool, 